Hello YouTube. Today I will give you 10 reasons why you should use a Mac. Though I am a PC user as well and I enjoy PC, I think Macs are just way better than PC. So let's get started without further ado. All right. By me, my novel maker. Number 1. Let's Windows talk first. Here's the Windows registry. It's very slow. Believe me or not. It's very unstable, and yet I got so many blue screen of death. Don't even ask me why. It's just unnecessary, because it's the clock's a system besides the file itself. And it's confusing, because there's so many root directories you have to access, such as each key local machine, each key local users. It's even confusing me. It just clogs your system, which is a major, major down point. And it's just a useless thing. No one should have to see this. It's bad. Mac OS X uses preference. Mac OS X uses system preferences to store settings which aren't confusing and does not really clog the system, which is a big point. Up, up, up. Two. The Windows Disk Defragmenter. They have a poor system management here. And it takes forever to complete a disk defragmentation. And it isn't always successful the first time. And you get frustrated easily. Even with third party disk defragmenters. Why should a Mac have to see or use this? It doesn't make any sense. It's just a plain pointless software. Number three. The pixelated fonts suck on window. Windows. I mean, look at these fonts in the registry editor. It's all pixelated. Who wants that kind of crap on their computer? And Mac OS X have higher quality font rendering engine. Number four. PC infections, PC. They're more vulnerable, and you have to pay extra cash for an internet security software just to protect you, which lags the system big time because you always get an unscanned virus, stupid thingy, that runs in the process and takes 99% of the RAM or CPU power. It's time-consuming upon repair and great risk of business and schools. It's a frustrating and tiresome to fix these infections. And it takes away your fun and work experience. experience. It's just plain stupid wasteful. I'm not saying that Macs don't need protections. They still need some little protections. protections. Number five. It's just not worth it to have a Windows PC sometimes because they're just bottlenecks especially when it's accessing stuff on the hard drive that takes freaking forever number six now let's Mac talk the best OS you'll ever use and love number seven the Mac App Store there are millions of apps for you many of them are free of charge and find the app just for you. Choose from categories that interest you. Made for Apple by Apple, so that means you can't run this on Windows. Not even with a perfectly hacked Mac app. <laughs> Thousands of games just for you, like Angry Birds and Fruit Ninja. Get OS X Lion there for $30 this month when it's going to be released. Number eight, the automator. The automator was introduced. What was introduced in Mac OS X Lion, and it, since then has been a great hit. So let's get started. You can assign the task for automator to do. You can execute the tasks. 
you can watch it as it does the tasks for you you can save the task for later use it is perfect for you and it's a great great assistant easy to use and it comes with the OS pre-installed already number nine time machine it's better than system restore on Windows seriously it's way better you can travel in time visually you can see the changes as you travel you have a one click stop to any chosen date you can back up to external storage better than Windows you can back up and, rest back up and restore anytime it's a real time machine seriously a real time machine and it's integrated with every Mac OS X build except for the 10.4 and earlier number 10 and this product is only exclusive to Mac OS X systems not Windows I work and I life Apple products compatibility only made for Apple products and it's way better than Microsoft Office suites you can create spectacular presentations you can have all the above all entertainment within iLife you can create awesome music you can create eye dropping videos with iMovie while well, you can create music with GarageBand you can think of all the fun actually think of all the fun you have and just add that to the Mac system and you have the ultimate entertainment system you'll ever have and it's not available for Windows so here's a huge point big the bonus and other products made by Apple so let's recap Macs do not use registry which is a big bonus point no Mac chassis or use this disk defragmenter Mac is smart about system resource management which saves you a lot of time and allow you the maximum fun fun rendering in Mac outbeats Windows and Linux overall computer in Mac is way better all around and better system management and less cable clutters, clutters means you have the space to put whatever you want on your desk without the cables being in the way with Max Thunderbolt port, anything is possible. Thunderbolt is proven to be faster than USB specifications. Your whole life is just incomplete without a Mac. And no major system infections like Windows are, have are on Mac, which is a big bonus point because you can, because you are saved three hours of probably probably dealing with viruses and junk. There are better software for your everyday life. Use Time Machine like a real Time Machine to make backup and restores. Use Automator to automate your tasks. Use iWork to make pleasing presentations like this one. Use iLife to create movies, music, and edit videos. I mean photos. Use Front Row as alternative to Windows Media Center. Use Office for Mac and do what you want to do. Download thousands of apps for your Mac and iDevices. With Apple iTunes, your music is finally at home. Just another thing, iTunes on Apple Mac is way better than iTunes on Windows. So what are you waiting for? Make the switch now, you will never regret it. This presentation is made with the iWork Keynote 09. And I hope this transitions and stuff make you want to get Keynote, but you have to use a Mac in order to use Keynote. So thank you for watching this presentation, you have been great, and I will release more videos in the upcoming future, so stay tuned folks, and don't bite into Microsoft, bite into an Apple.